G'day there guys, I'm Jesse Crow, the Travelling Scientist, and today we're going to be talking about targeted neuroplasticity training. Basically that's using electricity to help you learn faster. Remember that scene in The Matrix where Keanu Reeves is plugged into a computer and then suddenly he opens his eyes and he says, I know Kung Fu. Well, that technology is being developed as we speak. Targeted Neuroplasticity Training, or TNT, is currently undergoing research, which is being funded by the US military. The theory is that external stimulation of the nervous system might promote the release of neuromodulators, which are going to increase neuroplasticity and promote the formation of new neuronal connections throughout the brain. And by combining this increased plasticity with specific training programs, New skills could be learned and mastered at a much faster rate than traditional learning strategies. Recent studies have shown that external stimulation of the peripheral nervous system, that is essentially painless electroshocks to the skin, can promote the brain activity in areas that are associated with learning. And so by extending this research, scientists are trying to work out how to maximize that brain activity so that they can induce synaptic plasticity and improve learning. And as a result, individuals could really improve their intention span, their memory formation, and even their learning abilities. This type of bioelectric medicine could also be used to help people suffering from depression, attention deficit disorder, and other learning difficulties. Even serious diseases such as epilepsy could be treated with nerve stimulation to improve quality of life while reducing the need for invasive brain surgery or excessive drug treatments. Another advantage of bioelectric medicine could be the reduced number of side effects compared to neurotropic drugs. That's drugs that make you smarter. And while these drugs have been shown to improve your attention span and memory formation, they also have a number of unwanted side effects including headaches, anxiety, and they even lead to addiction. Meanwhile, the stimulation of nerves is specifically targeted and so it should have minimal side effects, although more research is still required to confirm this. Now the US military is researching this technology because they feel like certain skills such as marksmanship, cryptography and foreign languages require a lot of intense training which can be both costly and time consuming. But these certain skills are essential and can mean life or death in a military situation. Therefore the development of new methods that could rapidly improve human cognition could not only save time and money, but could also lead to saving a lot of lives in the future. Furthermore, and this is the really interesting part, the development of this kind of technology could lead to the future possibility of downloadable knowledge. The concept that if you want to learn something, you can just go online, find it, pay for it, click a button and download that knowledge straight to your brain. Become an expert instantly. Now, you can't do this right now, that sort of technology is still a little while away. What? But, you know, that's the kind of thing we're heading towards in the future. And it's super interesting, so I'm really excited to keep you guys updated about this concept of targeted neuroplasticity training. But anyway, that's all for today guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed and learned something, click the like button down below. And let me know what you think about this concept of TNT and downloadable knowledge in the comment section down below. Finally, I've been talking a little bit about the brain and I really want to do another video getting in depth with the brain. What do we know about it? How does the brain work? I want to teach you guys all about the brain. So that's going to be a video coming up real soon. Make sure you subscribe for Traveling Science every single week. I'll see you guys next Science Sunday. Cheers.